Hello YouTube, welcome back. It is story time today and uh, it's snowing yet again and uh, so I can drive my F-150 without four-wheel drive and do just fine. Uh, even a day like today, I don't know if you can see it out there, it's pretty snowy, All right? Even a day like that, I can make do with some decent winter tires, no problem. Don't need four-wheel drive. Can handle it just fine. Of course, the douchebag cat's got to come in, but he's not part of the story. He's not. He's not part of the story. Part of the story is I'm following behind two, that's right, two Subarus. One's a Forester, one's a Legacy. The Legacy's in the lead, and it's a new one. It's, it's not the old ones. I think it's like... Uh, last year's or year before last so it's fairly new the same with the uh forester and both very fairly new vehicles both of them all will drive none of them slip or sliding both of them however literally going 20 in a 45 20 miles an hour on a straight plowed salted road 20 miles an hour forester is the one ahead of me in the legacies ahead of the forester Forrester turns off to their home along 79, along, along the highway. They turn off. I'm like, all right, cool, 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 cool. One down, one to go. <laughs> no. So get, get what this cracked out junky looking lady does in this car. Now, mind you, she did, it looked like she did not belong in that car. She might have borrowed it from her mama or her baby mama or, or, or you know, baby daddy, whatever. It was not her car. There's no way it could have been because, man, she stops in the middle of the road. Slightly to the side, but basically in the lane. Like, I had to go across the yellow line to get around her. She stopped, had her window down, and she's mouthing, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not. You're a fucking idiot. This lady... Missing most of her fucking teeth, like her hair bunned up on the top. You know the look. You know what I'm talking about. Right for the school, pulls over, like not even all the way on the shoulder, just like a quarter of the way. It's like barely her passenger side of the car was barely over the white line. That's where she stopped dead. There's people behind me. There's people coming the other way. And now I cannot stop on a dime. Nobody can. I don't care how good your vehicle is, how good your tires. Is. You're not going to stop on a dime. Okay, now keep in mind, we're only going 25 miles an hour at best. So I go around her and she's mouthing, I'm sorry. Listen, if you're afraid to drive in the snow, don't. For everybody's sake and safety, fucking don't. Stay home, get an Uber, call a cab. Have whose ever car that is drive you where you got to go if possible. If not, it can wait until tomorrow. Like, oh my God. Like, obviously nothing happened or I would have put it on video and showed you guys, but it could have. That's very, very easy. Something could have happened with the roads the way they are and the snow coming down and everyone just seemingly to forget how to drive in the damn snow. Very possible that something could have happened because of that stupidity. Whatever reason she was stopping it, to me it seemed like the drugs were taking hold and she was freaking out and didn't know what to do and just rolls her window down to the guy that's behind her and says, I'm sorry. I wasn't yanking my fist. I wasn't like beating on the horn because my horn don't work anyway. I wasn't flicking my beams. I wasn't getting on her ass, nothing. I'm hanging back one or two car lengths back, Right. Why she rolled the window down was like, I'm sorry. Like, literally, like, that's I'm sorry. That's not, what the fuck, or help me. It's like, I'm sorry, I'm an idiot, and I'm cracked out of my fucking head. But anyway, that's enough for story time. That's enough for me ranting and raving about morons that live in New York State that have no idea how to drive when it's fucking snowing out. It's not that bad. As long as you're going on a straight line, you're fine. You don't got to worry about it. But anyway, that's enough. Like I said, uh, thanks guys for watching. Comment below. Tell me your guys' story about stupid snow drivers. Have a good one. Laters.